Hey everybody, Dave, caregiver here. Five minutes today is hammock wisdom. And what a unique opportunity in Atlanta to see a parade with the national champions. I'm assuming, not really a football fan. A lot of, a lot of excited fans out here waiting to show their trophy. <laughs> So that reminds me of some wisdom here. You know, back in the old days, we used to get trophies for um, for excellence. First place, second place, third place. I don't know exactly when it happened, but uh, we started handing out participation awards for those who maybe didn't do so well because we didn't want to make them feel bad you know and that sounds great on paper oh isn't that nice especially if you have a little son or daughter who isn't very athletic and she joins the softball team and you know maybe she's the worst player and she comes home with a trophy that's nice but i think they've gone a little overboard because they uh they, they don't encourage the kids to do their best. And I know this is a controversial topic and some people will probably argue with me, but it's hard to believe that college students are now having a mentality of, uh, you know, an entitlement mentality or victim mentality. It's like if something doesn't go their way or even if someone disagrees with them, they, they think that, I mean, just 20 or 30 years ago, I remember that the American Civil Liberties Union used to encourage freedom of speech. They used to say things like, you know, if you don't have to like this, but this is America and we have the freedom to express it. And yeah, it's true, we didn't like it, but this is America, everyone's entitled to their opinion, but apparently, Everyone isn't entitled to their own opinion in America anymore. You become bullied and you become uh, called a bunch of names. But I think that's political, isn't it? I shouldn't be talking politics. So, anyway, yay for awards, yay for trophies, yay for number one. Because everybody wants to be number one. Everybody wants to be with number one. Right? I can't remember who number two was. All right. Take care of yourself. Bye.